I'm delighted to be here this morning as we announce our partnership with the Kenya Tourism Board. I thank KTB, led by CEO Dr. Betty Radia, for your continued support. I also thank the Kenya Airports Authority for hosting us today. It is no longer news that COVID-19 pandemic has had adverse effects on the economy, not only in Kenya, but across the world. The aviation and tourism sectors have been hardest hit. As a result, it has become more important to constantly innovate to withstand the tide. At Jamujet, we pride ourselves in being agile and are constantly looking for innovative ways in which we can de-risk the business. Ladies and gentlemen, since inception close to seven years ago, Jumbojet has been relying solely on ticket sales for revenue generation. The COVID-19 crisis has taught us that this is not enough to survive as an airline, which is why we're diversifying our revenue streams. Last year, we launched our charter operations as part of this diversification. We also offer advertising placement at various points of the customer journey, including from the website to boarding passes, tray tables in the aircraft, in-flight activation, amongst others. Today, it gives us great joy, great pleasure, as we are unveiling our most progressive advertising asset, the aircraft wrap. Ladies and gentlemen, while countries often tend to focus on international tourism due to the revenue earned through exports, domestic tourism remains a leading form of tourism, representing an important tool for regional economic growth and development. In September last year, we launched the Now Travel Ready campaign to encourage travel in the new normal, showcasing what our different destinations have to offer as we demonstrate the measures in place to ensure their safety while traveling. Through the campaign, which is a partnership with various stakeholders across the country, we have reached millions of Kenyans and we are seeing them getting more comfortable to travel.